Hello guys, Sam Ryder here, and we're going to pick off where we left off on Shogun 2. And we're going to go ahead and go back to, of course, where we left off. And we have a few quotes from Sun Tzu on the bottom here. Oh, yeah, and you should definitely turn up the quality to HD so I don't have to read everything to you and you don't have to strain your eyes to see all the small blurry words everywhere. Well, they're not everywhere now, of course, but later. Already off to a great start, of course. And something I forgot to mention on the last episode is that on um, the Dante clan, if you remember, going back here, which is where they start off, they will also be making return. And since I actually, um, I'm actually one turn behind of where I left off, so what I'm going to actually be doing is I'm going to be making a, uh, Yaru Drill. No, I'm probably going to be making a archery dojo. It's going to take about two turns. Well, technically one turn now, turn now but I Yari I read that to you last episode and let's go let's go ahead and start off here. episode I studied the Shido lens, but I but it's it was automatically sent to Way of Chi, so I actually just uh, mastered the precursor to the Way of Chi board. And this is another mission. As our clan grows, so do we so do we oh so do we require additional means to support our military and cultural and of course trade with foreign powers will lead us to commodities and riches that cannot be sought out in Japan by establishing a trade port. Now we can construct ships with, with which to conduct foreign trade and we have to conduct a trade port which is um, an upgrade to I'm not going to probably pursue that for a while. And I'm going to go ahead and remaster this uh, Kenjutsu all the way down to this Kenjutsu mastery. And, oh, never mind, I was trying to explain to me, but it's actually the way I thought it was. And now the Dojo, I
武者どもいざ島津の誉れと度胸を見せてやれご先祖様たちも見ておられる我らの手柄を祝ってくださるに違いない敵にとってはここが正念場しくじれば歴史にも残らんいつの日か歌人が悲しい歌にして読んでくれることじゃろう今日の敵は武士の誇りのかけらもないやつらだ野心生まれで下げすまれながら死ぬやつらの腐った屍は恥という名の棺桶で葬られる死神を恐れながら戦う迷信深い者が我が軍にいるようじゃが気にするでないぞ目の前の敵を先に血祭りにあげれば死神は満足して立ち去るじゃろうよいか今後百年は島津と聞いたら泣く子も黙るそれほどにこの戦は島津の武勇を歴史に残す戦いになるであろう Quite good speech there, and I'm going to go ahead and explain all these units on the battlefield right now.、Um, starting out here, we're going to have our Yari Ashigaru, and they wield a spear. And as I explained earlier, they are bad against horses. I mean, no, they're good against horses, and they're bad against katanas and. and、uh, yeah, katanas. <laughs> The, this is the Yari Samurai. They are better than the Yari Ashigaru. They have a unique ability called Rapid Advance, which、uh, it increases the unit speed and charge bonus for a short time, but it also has to cool down. This is the General.、Um, he is a cavalry unit. They are, cavalry are good against swords, but they're bad against spears. Um, the general isn't a very good combat unit, and they are for、um, increasing the moral of the units around them. And because of this general, is the commissioner of warfare, the rapid advance unit, well, the、uh, Yari Samurai, will have a shorter cooldown. And this is the general. They don't fear. They are the default bow unit and they aren't particularly excelling in against any unit. They pretty much destroy any unit from a range, but they are bad at close quarter combat.、Um, cavalry, especially, are very good against them. And I'm going to go ahead and start. And since I'm, I'm not going to move my units up. Because I'm going to win by default if the time runs out. And I'm not sure how much this time is. It's pretty. It's a lot of time, and I'm probably not going to have.、Um, I forgot to turn down the volume for my general speech because my voice is far too soft while the volume's up. I'm going to go ahead and wait for them to come by. And this effect is on the battlefield is rain. And during rain,、um, I believe gunpowder weapons are very ineffective, and you cannot use、um, the fire arrows from the bow samurai units. So that's pretty lucky for us. And I think that. Rain also decreases the range of the ranged units, but I'm not quite sure.、Um, because I also know that happens with fog, but I'm not sure if. I'm not sure if that doubles for both. Anyways, I'm just going to go ahead and wait for the Yari Ashikaru to climb this cliff here, and I'm going to wait for them with my. Which will probably just about utterly destroy this large、uh, um, problem. They have another unit of bow ashigaru than I do, but I have far more、um, Yari units. And he also has two generals, so these guys nearby him are not very good.
general is in grave danger, my lord! clearly won. Viric victory is when you probably should have lost, but you technically won. And that kind of goes down to, um, you know, the one unit that, like, is at an absolute god on the field. And heroic victory is when you were, uh, you beat the odds, kind of. And that's the general I believe. Let's go ahead and see. Skilled. And we also have an increased rank for this channel. And the political happiness, which I explained in the last episode, because um, our garrison has been has left us. It's going to um, kind of hurt us a bit more. And I'm going to recruit some guys. Actually, the it doesn't matter right now. Oh no! And um, Tokugawa has been destroyed. That's not very surprising. Oh no! Maybe the new trait that oh, maybe it's only for the demo. I'm not sure. But usually, when you have a heroic victory, oh, it's only when you're defending that you get the uh, trait. And I'm not sure what it is. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and upgrade my strategist tree by two. And that's going to give us um, um, more of a range for walking across the campaign map. And these are retainers. Retainers are kind of like a special boost. We either have the 
Naginata Jutsu Master, which will increase our um, melee attack for the new goddess, Nag Nag Naginata Samurai, where we have the Sojutsu Master, which will increase the spear infantry defense for our command. And I'm going to go ahead and get this one, because the Nagata won't be featured until... <laughs> シャドモ。いざ島津の誉れと土俵を見せてやれ。ご先祖様たちも見ておられる。我らの手柄を祝ってくださるに違いない。敵にとっては、ここが正念場。しくじれば歴史にも残らん。いつの日か歌人が悲しい歌にして読んでくれることじゃろう。今日の敵は武士の誇りのかけらもない奴らだ。野心生まれで蔑まれながら死ぬ。